What's up guys, thank you for watching Franco TV. So today, I've made it to the Haunted Stanley Hotel. I still have a bit of ways of getting to the main entrance, but look how creepy this place is. Just walking out, taking it in to the main room area. This is the same place I was at the last time I was here and I woke up to a fire. I know that late at night, this room here gets really creepy because you'll hear certain things or switch when all the lights are off. You can already see how dim and creepy it looks. Just a couple of minutes ago before starting to record, I was already hearing footsteps out here. But I waited till where everybody was asleep and didn't have any more problems. If you're hearing noises, those are not farts. That's just the floor. It's uh, making some squeaky sound. It's my foot. <laughs> I switched it to this because my boots make way too much noise. So I went full blown commando. I took off the sock and everything. It increases the realism. <laughs> As you can see, I got this whole place to myself. Thank God, because sometimes it's hard to happen. Just wanna make sure there's nobody upstairs moving around. So I am gonna go ahead and start this video being inside one of the rooms. I'm gonna use a spirit box sessions, SLS camera, seeing if I could see, catch anything on camera. The last time I was here, I do believe I caught a weird, creepy shadow coming from inside that room on a night vision. And I'm not sure if that's the same thing that I'm not sure if that's the same thing that... Or was it SLS? I think it was the SLS camera. So I'm gonna go back in there tonight, seeing if I can get any connection or kind of communication with anything, because apparently the K2 kind of goes off in this room for some reason. You can already see how creepy it looks, just looking in there. this place so at this point now I'm gonna go ahead and get the equipment and get this thing going let's go I am now inside the same room in which I had two creepy apparitions I did mention the door but there was also something else that happened to me I had one of these doors from the bookshelves actually slowly Close. open up closed how many spirits are in the room with me How many spirits are in the room with me? It, I literally just said the door opened up and I have this set up. I didn't think it was gonna respond so quickly, but it just said closed. Um, I do wanna get in contact with the same spirit in this room that I got in contact with last time because this seemed to be one of the areas that was really strong among the other areas. That being said, Let's get into the video. Can you make a sound, a noise, something that I know I'm not here alone? Aaron. Aaron. Who is Aaron? Is Aaron someone that comes here? Someone who used to work here? Aaron? Aaron, if you're here with me, did you work at the hotel? Do you still work at the hotel? weird because subtly around the building I could hear bangs and movement but not within this room Aaron
Aaron, can you give me a sign that you're here? I just heard something. I can't. What uh, happened? I was hoping maybe you could tell me. Me. Yes. Angel. Angel. Again. Apparently, me, Angel, and again. Aaron, are you trying to say that you're an angel? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Seance. Seance. I just had something drive in front of the building right now. I think it's just extremely late. And it just said seance, and now my K2 is going off. Was there a seance in this hotel, uh, Aaron? Aaron? At this point now, I'm gonna see if I could go ahead and walk around. Um, there's another room that I do want to try doing this activity on the other room, but I am hearing subtle noises happening around the building. I'm not sure if it's anyone upstairs, but the best way to find out is to go up there, so let's get into it. Right over here is the area in which This door closed on me. I think my light is too bright. There we go. See how hard clock. it is? Did it say clock? Okay, it said, <laughs> it said uh, clock. There we go. This is the thing that opened up on me the last time I was here. Hello? I got the doors. I got the doors moving. Hello? Someone's in here. vision camera right on the other side watching. What is happening? You tell me. Aaron, is that so you who I'm talking to? I have this camera. They're here. Who's here? Love. Love. Well, that's exciting. Holy shit. All right. I literally have my night vision camera right over here recording everything right across from this room. Whoever messed with the door, were they friendly? Or were they from the dark? See? 
there is absolutely nobody outside and it's about three in the morning. I am now sitting in the other room in which I get a lot of activity from. I'm gonna be sitting in here, I'm gonna have a rim pod with me. I'm also gonna have a good old fashioned PSP7, which I'm gonna be turning from radio station to radio station. And there is something else I'm going to ask the spirits here if they don't mind taking from me. I didn't really talk too much into this. I thought about whether if I should talk about this or not. However, I've been having a lot of bad luck with something that I found recently. I don't know if it's actually this that's causing it. All I know is that ever since I got it, my luck has been downhill. So I think my time with the Indian goddess is coming to an end. I think I'm gonna leave this here in the Stanley. Um, I don't wanna take this with me. I am going to hide it somewhere in the Stanley. And of course, I'm gonna ask the spirits if it's okay. I'm gonna see what they give me as a response back from either the PSP7 or the Ovulus. Let's get into it. There we go. Let's hope that doesn't leak onto the table because if it does, I'll probably get in trouble. Right now I have the ovulus on, and I'm gonna go ahead and ask some questions. If there's any spirits here with me, I ask you that I wanna leave something with you here, and maybe you could protect me with it, or protect me from it, if it's what's causing the kind of things that have been happening lately. I'm not sure what's going on, I'm not an expert, but I do want to leave something that I do feel like it has been bothering me, and that is this object that's right here in front of me. Is there anything you would like to tell me? Hello? I'm gonna take that, that that's a sign that someone's here with me. Um, feel free to talk with the other black box that I have. Um, it would help you communicate with me and to be able to communicate with me. I'm also gonna be turning on a spirit box. That, that was me. May I leave this object that I found here? I wanna hide it somewhere within this hotel where nobody will be able to find it. Is that okay? What is here with me? Or who is here with me? It sounded like it said the captain. Are you referring to Jack Sparrow? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, a captain of what? I think there is a military person in the Stanley that's like had a room here up on the second or third floor, I think. That is the gentleman that haunts this floor. Mr. Dunraven. If you look right here, it says it even right there. Aaron, are you okay with me leaving this here? Asylum. Asylum. What about an asylum? This place has nothing to do with an asylum. All right, at this point, I'm gonna go ahead and turn her. off- Her. I'm gonna go ahead and turn off the candle. Holy shit, I just had a door closed on me. I'm gonna go ahead and turn off the candle. Holy 
Holy shit. I just had a door closed on me. This door just closed on me. radio the the spirit box just went off I hear noises coming from in there hold on I want to check in this room real quick I don't know what it just said Set with me? Oh, that's right. I have it on the night vision camera. That would have definitely picked it up. Are you upset with me? Nah. said not because I have this night vision right here watching the whole room I'm gonna start making my way towards the third floor and see what I can get actually went into this room. I completely forgot about that. 